I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. What's up, fuckers? Welcome back to fucking fucking fuck game fucking Grumps, motherfuckers. Hi. <laughs> Welcome to Game Grumps. That's neat that you're here. We're at the Temple of Time. Aaron's about to, uh... I've got a per <laughs> <laughs> Clearly, I've been paying attention. I've got a personal trainer. Uh, he's a really cool guy. He's a cool guy. And, uh, yeah, you see him too sometimes. Yep. Um, and... <laughs> You know, we talk about like what we do and stuff, and and he like learned more and more about the show that we do, mm -hmm. and then he was like, "Oh, I gotta watch the show." Mm -mm. And I'm like, "All right," because he's kind of like a like a like a clean cut guy. Mm -hmm. Um, I was like, "All right, well, sure." It's sort of like crude though, and he's like, "Ah, oh, whatever," and then. <laughs> <laughs> and then he like came back the next day and was oh, like, no. <laughs> he was like, "Hey, watch that episode you suggested to me." I, I turned it off though because. It, the subject matters a little bit too much for me. Right. Yep. <laughs> and, it, and it was the endless ocean episode, and it was like, like within one minute, we're just like, "I'm gonna fuck this crab" or something like <laughs> yeah. that. And I was yeah. Like, oh, oops. Why did I tell him that episode? I couldn't agree more. Why'd you tell him any episode? Why'd you tell him about anything we do? I don't know. It's fucking. I wanted to know what I did. That's fine. So I told him. Yeah. And so you like, should do what I do. Out. I did what I always do. Where they're like, I gotta fucking check it out. lie. <laughs> And I'm like, please don't. And he's like, ha ha ha. <laughs> please check it don't. out anyway. Yep. That's just how it goes. Yeah. Hey, I checked out that thing you do. I hate it. Yeah. Man, I warned him. But... Everybody should have lied in that circumstance. You should have lied. You should have said you're uh, a machinist. A and, machinist? And like should... Christian Bale yeah. in The Machinist? Y yeah, that's the one. And he should have been like, I didn't watch that show that you don't do. Because <laughs> you make machines all day. Is that what a machinist does? I don't even know if that's a word. Probably not. Machinist? I thought it was just a movie with Christian Bale where he lost like 3,000 pounds and then he, uh, then he did Batman right afterwards and gained like 3,000 pounds again. Yeah, he's um, really gone up and down. He's a- But now he clocks in at a svelte 2,980. <laughs> What if you were the size of a person, but you actually I am. did weigh 2,000 pounds? Uh... Wouldn't that be crazy? You anyway... Wouldn't, you wouldn't be the size of a person anymore. No, you would, but if your mass was like... Oh, you're just like crazy dense? Yeah. Ah, shit. There we go. Whoa, that's... Oh, nice job. Fart piece. <laughs> Sweetie. Hey, fuck you, bro! <laughs> crew! Crew! Go, crew! Go, Jon Snow, crew! Okay. Blue, crew! And blue, <laughs> blue from progressive commercials. Fru crew, <laughs> no crew. Anyway, I'm gonna push this block now. Boy, Flo's been the fucking progressive woman for a long time. She's now. hot. I, I like her. Do you think so? Yeah, I like her because she's hot. I guess a lot of people must think she's hot. She's super cute. I th I guess she is cute. Yeah. I don't really. I never really thought about it. Because she's not like sexualized at all or anything. And no, I just because I hate commercials. Oh. And I don't watch TV a lot. You love commercials. I do not. Yeah. Remember the commercial they always play on the Virgin Airlines that the. <laughs> love what? that commercial. Shoo up, shoo up, shoo up. Hey, hey, hey! I got some safety tips <laughs> that you ought to know, cause it's something that you wanna hear. So honey, zip your lips <laughs> and enjoy the show as we're moving to the stratosphere. <laughs> you better. <laughs> we can sing that. We fly Virgin Airlines all the goddamn time. Uh, yet another brand deal we don't have. And fucking God, we have to listen to that song constantly. <laughs> you better. <laughs> you know what? We should probably. Not everyone flies that airline, we should probably tell them. It's, uh, the safety video, so instead of, like, having the stewardess, like, show you how to buckle a seatbelt, they created, um, like, a really fucking in-depth five-minute, uh, like... Music video. Yeah, music video presentation. And, uh, you know, it's like a pop song. But Turn off your cellular devices just as fast as you can. And whatever you do! <laughs> Don't make me ask you again. So tonight, get ready to fly. Cause we're gonna live it all up in the sky. Virgin America knows all the places you wanna be. Fly away with me. Fly away with me. Yeah. Wow. Uh, 
Wow. You can't- We have seen that too many times. You can't visually see it, but I was slowly putting a gun into my mouth. <laughs> and shaking. Cause the, the first time you see it, you're like, wow, this is really creative. And, uh, maybe the 40th or 50th <laughs> time you see it, you're like, I'd, I- oh, please, sweet embrace of death. <laughs> Come for me before this is over. <laughs> we move into the strata! Dude, the last time I watched it too, they added a new verse. Yeah, about the life raft? Yeah! Yeah, I know! I was like, what the fuck is this? I stood up and screamed it. <laughs> <laughs> and I called the stewardess over and I was like, Miss! Miss! What is happening here? Care to explain? Give me an explanation. I need to- I am disrupted. <laughs> I am dismissed. You just start like yeah. bumping up. People are like, please can you No, you calm down! I can't remember what it replaced, but I'm like, fuck. What was so unimportant that they could have removed it? <laughs> They're just like, eh, seatbelts, whatever. Yeah, if you're in an exit row, fucking some shit. I don't care. <laughs> and and it took me like 20 views to realize that they're in an airport hangar. Oh, I did not even realize that. Yeah. They're like in an airplane hangar, and uh, and it's just like chairs set up in a fucking dark, creepy hangar. I'm turned on by the nerdy contortionist woman in that, oh, yeah? in that video, yeah. I hate the woman she's who pretty comes hot. out and she's like... <laughs> For those of you who've never used a seatbelt, I mean, what? Really? Yeah, I <laughs> yeah. hate her. <laughs> but like, she can't... How could you deliver that line? In like, a not annoying way. Yeah, I guess I hate the writers. Yeah, yeah, She <laughs> she was just doing her job. That's right, and she did it well, so... Absolutely. I also have a super crush on the blonde, uh... Um... Uh, Smoker? stewardess. No, she's not... She doesn't have any lines, she's just one of the dancing stewardesses. But she's really pretty. Oh, I know which one you're talking about. Call I've me! I've seen that commercial a million times. Call me, blonde stewardess lady! There's gotta be, like, an IMDb cast list for the fucking Virgin I America song. Well, you know my friend, uh, knows the main dude, the main singer. Really? Yeah, he's a very talented, like, I think he's like an artist who signed to Virgin Records, and that's why, like, they were oh. able to get him. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Would you look at that? Yeah. How about that nuts? Virgins are always talking to each other. I know, look at us. <laughs> <laughs> I'm an adult virgin. <laughs> oh shit, watch out. Fucking, this oh, motherfucker's gonna God. get me. Yeah. It, ugh. They are so hard to look at. He looks like... Like... <laughs> an AVGN joke. Oh, was yeah. it? I was gonna say, that was very clever. Thanks. Impressed that you thought of it. I didn't think of it. I know. James Rolfe thought of it. So now I'm, I'm impressed, even more impressed by him. That guy's fucking cool. But he doesn't want to see the Ghostbusters movie. And everyone got real upset about it. The, the fact that he doesn't want to see it? Yeah. Why is that? Because he's just like, I like Ghostbusters, I don't want to see it. And then everyone's like... How dare you? <laughs> How dare you not see a movie that came out like everyone does with 90% of all movies? Yeah. My boy, he was making a statement. He was like, I'm not gonna see it uh, because I don't like it. So that was yeah. it. And then people got all mad. That's a hell of a statement. Tons of people don't like remakes. I don't like remakes. Yeah. Except for the remake of Robocop, that one was really good. Was Just it kidding. good? No. It, yeah, it didn't look I good at all. I never saw it. Oh. it Gary Oldman, though. He's okay. great. There's one scene where, like, they disassemble him and he's just, like, a head and a brain and, and like, intestines and lungs and shit. Oh, and it, it's, sick. It's actually pretty cool. That's, like, the best scene in the movie, I think. The, is that- are you talking about the original or the new one? No, the new one. Ah. Oh. The original, every fucking scene is good. Yeah. It's fucking Robocop. It's so awesome. Robocop's the best movie ever made. I do love it. Fucking new neon Detroit. They're still making that fucking statue, man. Yeah. That was like one of the first Kickstarters ever, and I gave it five bucks. <laughs> and I still get updates like, we're still working on it, and it's like, how the f- It's been like six years, dude. Yeah, well, it's a big robot statue. How the fuck- How long does it take to make a fucking bronze statue? It's, uh... Does it, does it take a lot? Know. I don't know. These sons are really sad. Can you get that thing to swing around and make them all happy? Yep. Neat. Wait, what is that? Oh, what is damn. On here? There you go. Is there like an Inviso man here? I don't know. Oh, Whoa. there's a fucking Inviso hand here. Getting me all upset. Yeah, luckily the Fuck lens you, of Inviso truth. hand. Nice. <laughs> fucking tiny hands. Gross. Fucked up. Oh, you're not getting away that easily. Nice. Alright, cool. Now I'm safe. From any distractions. 
or injustices in the world. <laughs> did you ever read superhero comics? Uh, when I was younger, yeah. What did you read? Uh, I, my favorite one, honestly, was like the most D-list superhero, uh, it, uh, Darkhawk. He was my favorite. Darkhawk? I loved him. That sounds cool. He- he was- he is cool. He- they still bring him back every now and then. But like, they put him in- they later put him in a group called like, the League of Losers or something like that. What?! Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not fair. Like, the reject superheroes. He was like this cool blue, like, robot -y looking dude with like, sharp wings, and a little claw thing, and an amulet that shot energy. I loved Darkhawk. Fuck you! The League of Losers? Yeah, pretty harsh, right? That's so uncool. I know. But, what are you Why gonna do? fucking Superman probably put that shit together, because he's a fucking tool. Well, no, Superman's DC. Darkhawk oh, was Marvel? Darkhawk was Marvel, was yeah. probably fucking... Captain Marvel. Dr. Octagon. <laughs> Dr. Octagon? <laughs> Next time on Game Rubs! Next time on Game Rubs. Yeah, see you soon! Love you! I love you more. No. Yep. Well... Alright. Fuck you!